Welcome guys. We have just finished our workout at Planet Fitness once again, and now we are at the uh, Twisted District. So Twisted District in downtown Boise, Idaho. Uh, we're here to take on their Yard Dog Challenge. Uh, now the details about the challenge so far, it's a yard dog. So it's one yard, which is approximately three feet, and there's an, I believe there's an hour to finish it, and you get a choice of toppings or something like that, uh, and I believe it's 50 bucks if you don't finish, but I'll get the details inside. Check this weather out, it's not good, it's not a good day today, but you know, uh, I'm starving, went to the gym, and so let's go do this challenge. All right guys, so here we are inside the Twisted District to try their yard dog challenge. Now, this thing is massive, look at this. Woo, look at that. We've got a seven pound yard dog. Uh, we've got three different types that we got to choose from here. Uh, so we've got the traditional Chicago here. We've got the chili cheese dog in the middle, and then we've got the elote, I believe it is, which is a Mexican street uh, corn. So, uh, Different, three different combinations, it's kind of cool. We get an hour to complete it, and if we complete it within the hour, we get the $50 meal for free. Uh, and we also get quite a unique uh, t-shirt as well. So hopefully, if I win this, guys, I'll get to show you that as well. So thanks for joining, let's get started. All right, guys, so here we go, the undefeated yard dog challenge at the Twisted District. So uh, I'm gonna get started, we got a cool knife here to cut them up to the three different types. So uh, we're gonna get going here on the count of three, two, one, begin. One hour. There's the Chicago. Ooh. That's a good dog. Hey guys and welcome to today's challenge. We are here today in Boise, Idaho to take on the Twisted District's Yard Dog Challenge. The mustard's like a nice sweet mustard. There's a little tanginess in there so going down easy. As mentioned before, we have one hour to defeat this over seven pound meal. And if we do, we'll get the $50 meal for free. We'll also get one of those sweet free t-shirts up on the wall, as well as becoming the very first person to ever defeat the challenge. The camera always has trouble focusing on food for some reason. Chicago style hot dog down, now two thirds of the way to go. Next is the colote, I believe it is, which is the Mexican street corn. The hot dog's so big it doesn't fit on the bun. 
I couldn't find a bun that was that long. Surprisingly, this had to be my favorite out of all three flavors. Got a like, creamy or savory flavor in there. It's actually quite delicious. All right, guys, time for your input. I want to know which of these three flavors would be your favorite. Would it be the Chicago style, the chili cheese dog, or the Mexican street corn alote? Got some nice potato chips as well. Adds a little crunchiness to it. <laughs> hey, it may be a little bit unorthodox, but hey, at least I'm enjoying it, right? All right, so just over five minutes in, we're about halfway done the dogs, and then we got some chips to clean up as well, so. So about 55 minutes left, guys. Half the food is gone, and at this point, I'm just really enjoying the challenge. I might need some utensils to clean up the shrapnel around here. I think that instead of serving this to me on a platter, guys, I think it would have been better off serving it in a trough. Thank you. Excuse me. So this place is super packed right now. It was great that they got us in. It, I came in at uh, lunchtime. Uh, I don't think they realized how busy it was gonna be, but here we are. So just gotta keep eating. Especially this. Woo. Man, that thing alone. Look how loaded it is. Oh yeah. I apologize for the mess. And it was at this point that I realized I needed to switch something up. All right, new, new strategy. So I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of background about this challenge here at the Twisted District. I actually didn't know about this challenge until the day before. I was just going on foodchallenges.com, looking at some of my challenges and whatnot that I was going to be doing in the future here. And I came across this one and I was super excited. I gave them a call and they said to come on in the next day and we set this all up. All right, so. We're just over 10 minutes in, We've got a little bit of a hot dog, and of course the pile of shrapnel, the large pile of shrapnel I left. I got left over here. And I'm super excited, guys, to get this opportunity. I always get a question, have you ever done a hot dog challenge? And although I've done one other challenge at the Coney Island Cafe in Regina, Saskatchewan, that only had hot dog as part of the challenge and not the very main component so I'm very lucky to be able to try this one out today. All right, 12 minutes in, just a little bit to go. Hopefully I get under that 15 minute mark. All right, everyone, with just a couple of bites left, at this point, I just wanted to thank you for joining me on this very special edition of my road trip to Idaho. Uh, I wanna make sure that you guys enjoy the videos, and if you did, make sure you guys smash that like button and uh, also share with your friends and family. And if you're new to the channel, think about subscribing. I'd really appreciate all your support. And you know what, guys? Like I say, we'll see you on the next one.
Thank you. All right, guys, so 1447, that's the first, I'm the first person to defeat this challenge, so it is now undefeated. Uh, so I challenge anybody to come out here. It's a well-made challenge. It's a size where not anybody could do it, but if you can, uh, kudos to you. Uh, I really enjoyed all three hot dogs. I think I was very surprised by the Mexican olote, I believe it's called. Um, it was cooked very well and it was uh, had some nice savory uh, flavors and I wasn't sure what to expect with the corn and whatnot, but it was very delicious. Um, and yeah, I don't know, I had a great, great challenge. This is an awesome place. A big shout out goes out to the owners and management here for having me in at such a busy time on a Saturday afternoon during the rush hour. So I really appreciate that. If you guys are ever in the Idaho, Boise, Idaho area, come out, check out Twisted District. Maybe try one of their yard dogs. If not, all their other hot dogs are very large as well. So with that, guys, thank you for joining, and we'll see you on the next one.